Hey folks, it's Tony Fortunato from The Technology Firm. We're going to look at a feature in Wireshark, it's been forever, and a lot of people never use it, don't know how, don't know why, and I'm going to take this opportunity to show you with this trace file, it's called the decode as feature. So we have here a TCP stream using port 88 and 63755. It's part of a trace that I talked about in a previous video about a streaming issue. All right, I'm going to leave it at that. You can go find it. So in this case, it just says TCP. There's no application level data. And it would be kind of helpful if we had it. One way to kind of get it is to just right click on the packet. And then you can go to follow TCP stream. And you can see stuff here. And you see RTSP, describe, unauthorized, so on and so on. And so there's a lot of good stuff in here, right? Um, but it would be helpful if it was there. I mean, it'd be helpful if it was here instead of in that dialog box. So what do we do? Well, let's go to Analyze. We'll go to Decode As. Let me pull this back over. I'm gonna hit the plus sign. And TCP port, yes. And we're gonna choose the default value it put in there is 63755. In this case, it really doesn't matter which one I use because the trace is so small. But in the real world, if you had a huge trace, then you'd want to make sure you're using the proper port number. There's no easy answer to that, all right? You just got to keep your eyes open and try it out if you're not sure. I'm going to leave everything alone, and I'm going to go to the current field, and I'm just going to type RT. It's going to jump down to that area, and I see RTSP right here. I'm going to hit OK. And now magically, look at that, huh? Now we can actually see the RTSP data. And conversely, it will decode the RTP stuff. And you can see all sorts of helpful information there as well. That's it. I'm going to keep it short, easy. Try it out. If you're ever stuck, it doesn't hurt. And you got a lot to gain, nothing to lose. Have a good day, folks. Bye for now.